Matt, we're in the midst of a, a busy period in your, your schedule. How's everyone got through it so far heading into Saturday's game? Yeah, I think we're, we're okay. We're not too bad. We've got a couple of bumps and bruises. We've got um, a couple of tired legs from the, for the couple of games we've played already. Um, got a long trip ahead of us, so we've got to be mindful of that. But I think everyone's in good spirits. Obviously, we we feel like um, we've had a good start to the week and the four points from the two games, which we're pleased about. But um, yeah, we're busy preparing for for Carlisle away on Saturday, which we're we're really looking forward to. And when you have got a, a long trip like Carlisle, it helps to know the the run you're on, the fact that you could have six away wins in a row should things go your way on Saturday. Yeah, I think the um, the belief and the confidence that we've taken from the previous five games on the road is, is obviously valuable to us, but we've spoken a lot um, in the last couple of weeks about starting every game at zero. You know, I think we discussed it last week that you can take confidence and belief from the previous results, but you have, can't get carried away of it. Every, every game starts with um, having to be ready at that first whistle, so we're... You know, obviously, go get on the on the coach tomorrow in, in good spirits. We're looking forward to the game, but we uh, we fully respect the fact that Carlo are a very good good team in this league, um, really good manager, and obviously, you know, huge pedigree in the game, which um, is of you know extreme value to them. Um, and we know that we, they're a team that we need to respect. But obviously, in our own in our own camp, we're we're pleased with how things have gone recently. And we we want to have confidence and belief in ourselves. And they are a side that are going well in this league. A couple of indifferent results of late, but not a side to be underestimated. No, certainly not. I think they're a very, very good team. Um, obviously, I watched their game against Barrow a couple of weeks ago, um, just before we played Barrow, and we've watched their footage the last two days. We've spent sort of studying them a little bit about what, what they do. Um, yeah, certainly not going to underestimate them in any, any way. They've got some really good players, a really good team. Been going well all season, like I say, so... It's a real tough game. I think maybe their recent results and, and a lot of games recently have shown that, you know, League Two is a tough, tough league. You know, you can't underestimate any game against anyone in, at any spot in the table. So you have to be really ready for um, for the game ahead. So um, yeah, we we respect what they do. I know they're a good team. They've got some real good players, and um, yeah, we know we're in for a tough afternoon. And results for for your side have been pleasing over the last few weeks. But something I know you'll definitely be pleased about from the the last few games is in the last couple of games of the, the clean sheets? Yeah, most certainly. We've spoken about it this morning already in the meeting. We, we've spoken about what it takes to get a clean sheet. Um, it doesn't just doesn't just happen. <coughs> um, you know, uh, I think there's been a lot of... Uh, and that's from the front as well, by the way. It's not just Kieran. It's not just the boys in front of him or the midfielders. It's right from the front. It's about um, carrying out the, the tactics that we've, we've we put a lot of time into to, to going through. It's about having that will, the desire to... Um, you know, stop crosses, block shots. Um, you know, all the little bits around the um, positioning and, and communication. It takes so much to go into it. So obviously, we're, we're pleased about that. But again, um, you know, we want to make sure we finish off the week well. And someone who has been central to that is Luke Chambers. How's he? He's okay. Yeah, he got a bit of a bump the other night, um, and he was really honest in terms of um, not being able to carry on. Um, he didn't want to let the team down because again, it was. A uh, game that was finding the balance. He got a bit of a knock on his ankle, but he seems to be recovering well. So we just um, give him as much time as he needs to, to get himself ready.